Zap, 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 lightning, zap, zap, lightning, lightning, fade out. Hello, it's me, the LEGO Dude, and in today's video, I will be talking about all the new leaked Summer 2022 LEGO Star Wars sets, and how these new leaked Star Wars sets will affect all the open and unknown spots left on the list of LEGO Star Wars sets that will be releasing in 2022. Almost every single set number for 2022 has already been taken up by either a strongly rumored set or a set that's already been released, but there are six empty spots left. The 75331, which will be the $530 UCS or MBS set. The 75334, which will be the $50 set with 408 pieces. The 75337, which will cost $140 and will have 1,082 pieces. The 75338, which will cost $70. The 75339 and the 75342. Now, the first new leaked and rumored set that we're going to talk about is the $40 Republic Fighter Tank, which will take up the 75342 number. I think it will have in the range of 300 pieces, and I thought that this rumor might have just been fake because it didn't have that much backing, but now it seems like it'll actually be released in summer of 2022. This Republic Fighter Tank will look almost exactly like the old Republic Fighter Tank that released a few years ago, and it'll also be about in the same price range and piece range as the Imperial Armored Marauder. It'll also have four minifigures like the Imperial Armored Marauder. The Republic Fighter Tank will have one Mace Windu minifigure, two 187th Normal Clone Troopers, and one 187th Airborne Clone Trooper. This is a very generous amount of Clone Troopers for a $40 LEGO set, but it seems like LEGO have had a change of heart and are actually willing to give more than just one Clone Trooper in a LEGO set this size. That's originally why I thought that this rumor was fake, but now it turns out that it's actually true. And the second new rumored set we're gonna talk about is the 75339 $90 Death Star Trash Compactor. This was also originally thought to be a fake rumor, but now it turns out that it's actually a true rumor and LEGO will be releasing it in summer of 2022. This set will also have four minifigures, Han Solo and Luke Skywalker in Stormtrooper armor, Princess Leia and Chewbacca, and it'll be pretty much the Death Star trash compactor. It'll have a bunch of pieces to represent trash and I think it'll also have the trash monster that was in the Death Star trash compactor. This set will also be an 18 plus display set so it's not really for playing with, it's mostly just to put on your shelf for display. These two new leaked sets though might be a problem because there are six unknown sets left for 2022, but if you add in these two new leaked sets there's only four completely unknown sets left for 2022 in LEGO Star Wars. I was hoping that from these six unknown sets that one would be a Playscale Republic gunship and one would be a Jango Fett Slave 1, but now that is looking extremely unlikely because two of the six unknown sets have been taken up by these two new leaked sets, which means there's only four unknown LEGO Star Wars sets left for 2022. One of those four unknown sets is the $530 UCS or MBS set, which I'm sure will be the Geonosius Owena or the Battle on Endor, which means that there is only realistically three unknown sets left for 2022. And with the new Andor and Kenobi shows coming out later this year, I'm sure that these last three sets will be based off those shows, and maybe one will be based off the Book of Boba Fett. I'm thinking one will be based off Kenobi, one will be based off Andor, and maybe one will be based off the Book of Boba Fett. Now that I've finished talking about that, I will talk about my predictions for these three unknown sets. I think that the 75338, which will cost $70, will be the Wangkor Wampage or Wangkor vs. Scorpionite set, based off of chapter 7 of the Book of Boba Fett when the Wankor rampaged through the city of Mos Espa and it fought the Scorpionek droids. For the $140 set, I think that it will be the Inquisitor Fortress that we saw in the trailer of Kenobi. For a set that big, I don't think there's anything else they could really make that's based off Kenobi except for the Inquisitor Fortress. And for the $50 set, the only thing I can predict is it'll be based off Andor, because we haven't gotten a single trailer or teaser trailer for Andor yet, so I can't really predict anything that this set could be that will be based off the Andor show. Which means that really the only information we have is it'll be based off Andor. And that is everything for today's video everyone. Tell me what you think about these new set rumors and what you think that the last sets left for 2022 will be. Remember to subscribe to my channel and leave a like. Bye. Created by the Lego Dude. Produced by the Lego Dude. Directed by the Lego Dude. Paid for by the Lego Dude. Edited by the Lego Dude. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave a like.